Hey guys, Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. We're going to break down Eleanor Rigby by the Beatles. Uh, also, if you're trying to get deeper into learning guitar, I have some free step-by-step -step courses that I think will really help you. So check the links down there for all the different various goodies. And if you haven't yet, I appreciate you subscribing here to the Marty Music YouTube channel. Thank you for that. And uh, let's break it down. Well, in the simplest terms, this could actually be one of the easiest Beatles songs. You play an E minor chord. C major. This is a dream. Back to E minor. Singing the melody over that one chord to C. C, 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 C. So that main part, literally E minor to C, two great beginner chords that you would want to learn to play guitar anyway, and an awesome song. So then, all oh, the lonely people, you could just sing it all over E minor. All the lonely people, where do they all? You could just sing it over E minor, but if you add whatever finger's comfortable to the third fret B string with that E minor, that's called E minor seven. Then you move it down to the second fret B string, and that could be called E minor six, E minor flat six, I guess you could say, but it'd be the first fret. Theoretically, it doesn't matter. Third fret, second fret, first fret on the B, and then regular E minor. So. Belong. Oh. Where do they all come from? Back to E minor, singing the melody, da 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 da, then C. Da 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 da, E minor again. E minor melody, da 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 da, da C. Da 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 da, da. Oh, next part. Third fret B string, second fret, first fret, open E minor, E minor seven, E minor six, first fret B string, and then the final part. C, E minor. And so that's all you need to sing and play it on acoustic guitar. But since I was playing that melody in the intro, I'll show it to you in case you want to be able to play instrumental version or play with another guitar player. So I won't get into too deeply into the scales that you need, but you basically want to use the E minor pentatonic scale as the outline. Um, but, there, you know, there's a few little notes around that as well but so so da da second fret g four open g and then the e note on the second fret d so from there open g second fret g open b and then third fret, but I'm sliding into it just for a little bit of juice, a little bit of a little bit of grease on that. So bra two o two, and then open B to second fret G, and then on that G string two o two. So from the top. And then O two four five four starts over again. So 
So all the lonely people, 202, 402 on the D. And then hit that second fret D again. And then hop an octave. So I'm going to do the uh, fifth fret B string. And then right to the fourth of the G. Down that pentatonic. Four, two, oh, two on the D. So. New part. And so I'm doing that, and instead of the root, I'm going up to, which is, I'm playing it on the eighth fret B string. It's also, you know, it's in that pentatonic, but so. And then I'm hitting the fifth fret B, hopping over to the four of the G again. Two, oh. So, uh, Finally, the people. You could play the open high E, but I'm just keeping it in a scale shape. So that uh, fifth fret B string. Two, three, five, three, two, five on the B. So uh, two, three, five, three, two. Five, and then a slide from four to two on the G, open G. So. And that's it. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the lesson. Don't forget I got free courses in the links below and I appreciate you subscribing here to the channel. Thanks again, hope to see you later.